Good evening. Good evening. Can you hear me? Hello. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello. How are you doing today? I'm fine, thank I am fine, teacher. Okay. Good. Welcome, um, Gilberto, Andres, Katy. Wilber, Mauricio. Okay, welcome to the class number 14. Okay, today we're going to start unit four. Okay, so we're going to start um, the topic about past tense in the unit four. Thank you so much for being here. Okay, um, let me share my screen. Okay, today is July 21st, 2023. Good evening, teacher. I go. Be home. <laughs> Sorry? I can't be home in five, 15 minutes. Five or 15 minutes. Okay. It's okay. Thank you. No problem. Okay. Um, the agenda for today, we have a lesson objective, then we have a verb V in past tense, and we have a conversation practice at the end using the past tense of verbs. Welcome, lady, Salvador, Mauricio, Hazel, Silvia. Welcome, everyone. Hello. Hello. Aquí no hay luz. <laughs> Aquí no hay luz, no sé cuánto me va a durar la carga. Oh, okay, understood. Thank you, Sylvia. I know if you get disconnected, it's because um you don't have uh, how to be connected, okay? Okay, the lesson okay. objective for these classes is talk about past tense to describe previous job experiences, okay? We're going to use the past tense, okay? So I have the first activity. It is related to the verb to be in past. Okay, let me see. Maybe not working. some moment. I don't know why it's not working the link. <clears throat> yeah, let me take Good evening, teacher. Good Everyone. evening. Good evening. How are you today? Good teacher, good. Okay, good. A little bit um because the earthquakes a little bit hard. <laughs> oh okay, I understand. Okay, I hope that um everybody is okay, right? And you you don't you don't feel afraid that um I don't know if you feel afraid when it it happens but i hope that everybody is fine okay good uh <clears throat> we're going to identify here the pronouns 
which belongs to or which uh, pronoun we're going to use with was or where okay tell me uh the ones that we use with was he i i he 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 she and he okay and we where you you we we they and they they okay very good remember that <clears throat> that is a way that you are going to use uh the verb to be okay in past tense Okay, good. Then we have here um, another exercise that is about um, organize, okay? Organize the sentences. Okay, I don't know. The sentence is a scramble, teacher. You were? Scramble, a scramble sentence, yes. Just a moment, please. I don't know why the links are not working. Normally, they work, but I don't know why. Now, I'm not working. Okay, which which uh word will be first? Mm -hmm. I was. I was. I was at home last was night. At... Last night. Last night. Home. Okay, I, I, I was, was at, at home, home last night. Okay. Okay. He was. He was. He was. Okay, she was at school yesterday. Mm -hmm. then, yeah. uh, he was he my was... friend. He was my friend. He was my friend. He was my friend. Okay. Then, yeah. it, it, it was, was a small dog. A small, small dog. He was small dog. Okay. They were at. They were at. Classmate university. They were classmates at university. university. We were. We were. We were. At the beach at last. last Beach, the beach last summer. Okay, we were at the beach last summer. Okay, you were no, you were, were tired last night. Okay, you were tired last night. So, yeah, you were, you were at, at home. Es pregunta. Mm -hmm. It is the question. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? At home last night. Okay, very good. Where are you at home last night? Okay, here we have another question. Was she? Was she? Uh, in? Sería. Uh, she, a, a doctor, doctor in Buenos Aires. In Buenos Aires. Okay, she was a doctor in Buenos Aires. Okay, good. She wasn't my class classmate. She wasn't my, my, my classmate. classmate. 
You weren't here you yesterday. Were here yesterday. You were here. Mm -hmm. You weren't here yesterday. Okay, very good. Here we have the answers. Okay, if you have questions, please, please let me know. Very good job here. Okay, quick questions for you. How often do you attend trainings? What other events do you take place at your workplace? Besides training, what other events do you receive in your workplace? I mean, do you attend in your workplace? Mm -hmm. Parties, meetings, launch, maybe. Conference. Meetings. Conferences. Meetings. Mm -hmm. Meetings, conference. Um, okay. Activity webinar. in deep Capacitation. Trainings. Mm -hmm. Trainings. Okay. Every month. Every webinar. Week. Webinars. Okay. Curses. Okay. Very good. How often? Every week. Every week? Every week. Maybe okay. monthly training. Once at uh, the mo at month, um, but meetings, conference, maybe weekly. Uh -huh, meetings and conferences. Every week. Every week. Okay. Yes. Every week. Okay. Okay, good. We have here um conversation using um past tense, okay? Let me read it for you first and then you're going to read it. It says, hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me anything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Mm, let's see, Andy Johnson from, from England. And Magali Sinini, Sinini from Brazil. I love Mrs. Uh, Mrs. Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You are right. Ah, okay, like this no kidding is like an exclamation, okay? Like a surprise, okay? No kidding. No kidding, okay? Who were the speakers, okay? So, as you can identify here, in it is in bold, letter bold, negritas, okay? Um, to, to make emphasis in the past tense, okay? In this case, it's asking one question using past tense. Did you attend the training last week? Okay, yes, I did the answer, okay. The training was, okay, was means talking about past, okay. It was at the new hotel. It was difficult or it wasn't that difficult, but it was challenging, okay. Another question here, 
who were the speakers, okay? She was the first, okay, international CEO. There you can identify that moment that we use past tense. Okay, very good. Okay. Um, who wants to participate? Just let me know. Thank you so much. Okay, Andres and Lady first. Okay, teacher. I'm going to Mm -hmm. Andres, you, start? Be, you you can start, Andres, and Lady Lorna. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hello. Se me fue el inter. You start. We can hear okay. you. Okay. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The, the training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about about it. What is what is difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but I was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Um, let's see, Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Mr. Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. Okay, Miss Sanini. Okay, Mr. is when we use MR. And that is the uh, mom. Uh -huh. In this case, she's a woman. Miss. Miss. Mm -hmm. Miss. Mrs. Miss Sanini. Okay. Yes. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much, Andres and Lady. Now, Hazel and Carlos. Okay. Okay. Hey, Lorna. And Lana. Okay. Hey, Lorna. Okay, go ahead. How are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. What is difficult? Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Oh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. Thank Thanks, you. Carlos. Okay, thank you. Okay. Thank you so much, both of you. Very good. Awesome. Okay. Awesome. 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 Thank you. Okay. Now, Katy and Gilberto. Okay. Really, Katy? Okay. Hey, Lorna. How are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. So great. Tell me everything about was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very changing. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speaker? Mm, let's see. Andrew Jackson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. 
I love Miss Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO, CEO the, to visit our company two years ago. You are right. Thanks. Thank you. Okay, very good. Just repeat. Sounds great. Sounds great. Sounds great. Sounds great. Sounds great. Okay. Uh, Kathy, challenging. 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 When it's challenging, means that was difficult. Okay, that maybe you have some difficulties to understand, but but you did it. Right, was challenging. Okay. Okay. Good. Thank you so much. Uh, okay, now Cindy and Robert. Are you ready, Cindy? Ready. Okay. Hey, Lana. How are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was handsome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. What was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speaker? Um, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You are right. Okay, very good. Okay. We're going to make a link here. Was it? Okay. Unimos los dos sonidos. Was y el it. Was it was difficult? It. Was it difficult? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Was Perfect. it difficult? Yes. Thank you so much. That was good. Okay, we have we we have Sil Sylvia. Who else wants to participate with Sylvia? Someone else? Okay, thank you. Someone who wants to participate with Sylvia? Okay. Hola, hola. Let me see if let me see. Mm. Rolando, are you available? Rolando Danilo? Okay, teacher. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Hi, Lorena. How are you? Did you eat them um, the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was a uh, awesome. It was at uh, the new hotel. Hotel. Some great. Tell me very things about it. What 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 is difficult? Well, it was wasn't uh, the difficult that my that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speaker speak speak can't. No, no kidding. Who were the speaker? Oh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali eh, Sanini from Brazil. I love Mrs. Sanin. She has. She, she was uh, their first in, international. Sito to visit our company two years ago. You are right. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Okay. Awesome. Okay. Awesome. Here. Also. Awesome. Okay. Awesome. Vamos a, a, a hacemos ca, como cuenta que no existe la W y la I. 
la, la, I, la E. Ok. Awesome. 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 Uh -huh. Ok. Hotel. Hotel. Uh -huh. Sounds great. Sound great. Sounds great. Sounds great. Uh -huh. Challenging. Challenging. Speakers is plural. Speakers. Speakers. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. You are right. Okay. So, thank you so much, guys, for your participation. Do you have questions about this? Vocabulary? Do you have vocabulary, new vocabulary there? No? No questions? Hidden teacher. Sorry? Hidden es nombre o, o qué está diciendo ahí? Donde dice Lana, no kidding. It's like a, it's like a, en ¿Es serio, no está, no está bromeando algo así. Ah. No es una broma, no está bromeando. Uh -huh. Ok. 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 Um, I have some questions about this conversation. Read it again and I will ask you some questions. Ok. Okay, how does Lorna describe the training? Do you remember how does Lorna describe the training? Awesome. She said it was, it was, it was awesome. It was all awesome. And also was challenging. Was was um was difficult, but not that difficult. It was challenging. Right. Okay. Uh, when was the first time that Mrs. Sanini came to the ladies' company? Do you remember? Mm -hmm. Do you remember when was the first time they mentioned that? Miss Anini, mm -hmm. speaker international to Brazil. Okay, Miss Anini is an international speaker from Brazil. She came to the company, they said, two years? Two years ago. Two years ago. Okay, very good. Okay, where did the training take place? Do you remember the place? Mm. In mm -hmm. the hotel. It was at the new hotel. It was in a hotel. Okay, very good. There you can confirm the information. The new hotel, yes. I don't know why, but, but I'm sleepy now. <laughs> Maybe because it's Friday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my yeah. God. I don't know why. Okay. Day off. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's Friday. Day. Yes. Okay. I have a, a couple beer in my freezer. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, so... We're going to do it, okay? So um, we are missing just one hour and a half, okay? So thank you so much for that uh, information, okay? 
how do we use there be in past? So that is what I want that you remember. Use the past of be to talk about situations in past. We already reviewed that we are going to use was with I, he, she, and it. And we are going to use where with we, they, and you. Okay. We have affirmative statements here, examples. The training was very helpful. All employees were happy to attend. Negative statements. It was no or it wasn't difficult. There are two ways to to say that. Okay. Normal way was not or contraction wasn't difficult. Okay, we were not or we weren't unwilling to help. Do you know what is unwilling? Oh, Carlos, do you want the unit for you? Do you don't have it? Excuse me, teacher. Carlos Arsenio, do you have the unit for or do you need it? Ah, uh, uh, I don't love the, the, the website. Oh, oh you, you already have it. Okay, good. Yes, yes, thank you, thank you. Sorry, I didn't see your, your message before. Okay, what is the meaning of un unwilling? Unwilling. Do you remember that or not? What is the, the me, okay, what is the meaning of willing? Si le quitamos el UN, ¿cuál, cuál es el significado de willing? Do you remember? Dispuesto. Dispuesto a, okay, happy to do something if needed, right? But if you are unwilling, it's because you are not, you are, I mean, because you don't want to do it. Maybe because you are sleepy or because you don't want to do it, but you are unwilling to do it, right? Okay, very good. Uh, we are going to practice also how to make questions with the verb be in past tense. Yes. Okay, good. Um, sure. Yes, Carlos? Uh, in which case I use was and, and where? Which cases? When you are speaking about past tense, um, but keep yes. in mind, keep in mind that we use I, he, she, it, was, okay? Always will be this was and the other three uh pronouns we they you were okay but the, training, the training is like a it maybe the training was uh-huh that is it the training was very uh -huh. helpful mm -hmm. employees is they they mm -hmm. uh, thank you thank you teacher all the employees were happy to attend. Okay. Okay, here we have information. We have a, a paragraph, a short paragraph. Uh, that it, it has information in past tense. It says, Mary went to training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment she uses and how to prevent damages on it. The presenter was really helpful and he clarified all doubt. May I had he used a computer to present examples during the speech. Okay, who wants to read it for me? For everybody, someone? Volunteer? Okay, Andres, you first. Hey, teacher, read the paragraph below and answer the question. Mary 
Mary went to a training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment she used and how to prevent damage on it. The presenter was really helpful and he clarified all the doubts. Dub, dub. Mary had he used a computer to present examples during the speech. Very good. Equipment. Repeat that. Equipment. 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 Correct. Okay. What is an equipment? Do you remember? Equipment is like a, like yes. a, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, an equipo lady. Um, okay, thank you. Okay, lady, go ahead. Mary went to training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to see, to fix the equipment she used and how to prevent damages on it. The presenter was really helpful. And he clarified all doubts. Mary have he used a computer to present examples during the speech. Okay, thank you so much, lady. Damages. Repeat that. Damages. Damages. Mm -hmm. Damages. Damages. Prevent damages Damages. on it. Damages. Damages on it. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Thank you so much. Um, the other word will be... Doubt. 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 Because plural. Okay. Carlos. Okay, teacher. Uh, read the paragraphs below and uh, answer the question. Mary went to a, a training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment she used and how to prevent damage on it. The presenter was really helpful and he clarified all dogs Mary had. He used a computer to present example during the speech. Okay, thank you so much, Carlos. Okay, Silvia, go ahead. Okay, teacher, uh, sería, uh, Mary went to a training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment. She used and who to prevent a uh, dent or if the present was really helpful. And he clarified all about Marriott Hunt. He used the computer to present examples during the speech. Okay. Okay. Uh, Tuesday. Repeat that. Tuesday. 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 Interesting. Interest. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Learned. Learned. Fix. 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 Equipment. Equipment. Damages. Damages. Clarified. Clarified. Um, Doubt. Doubt. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank Cindy? Okay, teacher. Mary went to a training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment. She used it and how to prevent damages on it. The presenter was really helpful, and he clarified all doubts. 
Mary have? He used a computer to present an example during the speak. Speech. Speech. Uh -huh. Doubt. Doubt. Okay. Okay, good. Now mm -hmm. help me to answer these questions. How was the training? Was, was interesting. Was interesting. Okay. She was at who? Okay. When was the training? I'm sorry. In Guatemala. When? Last Tuesday. Last, last Tuesday. Tuesday. Last Tuesday. Yes. Did you like it? Yes. Okay. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Okay. What did you learn? To prevent damage on it. To prevent damage on the equipment, right? The equipment. Mm -hmm. Was the presenter uh, helpful? Yes. Yes, he was. He was. Yes, he was. Remember, this is like a yes, no questions. Short, short answers, but uh, you... He answered. or she? We're talking about the presenter. We're talking about mm -hmm. he, okay? Mm -hmm. if, we, if we ask, was the presenter helpful? Yes, he was. He was, right? It okay. was, it was he. Uh, 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 I guess it was he. Um, it doesn't mention, but let, let's say, let's suppose that that is he. Okay, did he use examples? Yes. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Okay, remember, when the question starts with did, the answer will be if the it is yes, will be yes. Yes, he did. He did. If that is no, will be no, he didn't or did not. We're going to see more examples. In an, okay. 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 Here we have examples. Um. I don't know what is happening. <clears throat> yeah, let me. Let me take the link. I don't know why it's, it doesn't open directly to the page. Okay, birth, birth to be simple pass. Here we have an exercises that we're going to complete. Okay, read. We're going to use was or where? I was. was, was I was at a I school at yesterday. Okay. Gary and Sue. Where? Where at school? Where? Were at a school yesterday. At a school. They. They were. Where? At they the dance were. last Friday. They were at the dance last Friday. We, we were. 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 We were, were at this. 
at the we seaside last summer. Last summer. Last summer. Last summer. Was. I was. I at was the at meeting. the meeting last Tuesday. Last Tuesday. You were. What? You were. You were. Uh, you were on the basketball team high, high school. That you was. 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 Ah, uh, no. No. Teacher. Where? 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 Where that your mother in the car? Mm -hmm. He was. Was. He was a great tree climber 10 years ago. Where? Were you kind and helpful to your friends? Were you kind and helpful to your friends? Was. She was a beautiful girl. She was, was a beautiful, beautiful girl. girl. Yes, they were very good at English. They were very good at English. They don't wear. They don't wear. They don't wear. In the, In the living room. room. Okay, very good. So now we're going to change then. We're going to make the equations. Okay. Uh, Gilberto, number one, how will be that question? Uh, una, una sentence, teacher. Question? Yeah. Question. We're going to make equations. There okay. we have the sentence. But was, I, was, was I a school at yesterday? Yesterday. Okay, good. Lady, number two. Where get Gary? Where Gary and Sue at school? Okay, good. Yesterday. Yesterday. Sorry. Uh Carlos, number three. <laughs> Number three, mm -hmm. were they at the dance last Friday? Okay, good. Number four, uh, Andres. Uh, were we at the, the side last summer? Seaside. The seaside summer? last summer. Okay. Yes, Daniela, number five. And I was at the meeting last Tuesday. How do you're going to make a question with that uh, sentence? Uh huh. How will be a question? Mm. Someone who wants who can help uh Daniela please. Okay. Was. Was, was I in the meaning last Tuesday. Okay, very good. Rolando, please number six. Was you on the basketball team in him? Was you or were so, you? Where, 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 where you? Were you on the me, basketball? Were you on the basketball thing in the him school? The high school. High school, high mm -hmm. school, okay. Sylvia, number seven, please. Ahorita, ahorita teacher. Oh, number seven yeah. is already a question, okay. Uh, number eight, sorry. Number eight, Sergia. Eh, ¿Tengo que contestarla? No. Tengo There que you have a positive sentence, but you're ah, going to make sería, an equation. Uh, okay. That's a pregunta. Was, uh, was he a great that Klim, Klimber team years ago? Was he a great three climber 10 years ago yes 
Mm -hmm. Okay. Hazel, number 10. Thank you. Sorry. Oh, was he a beautiful girl? Okay, very good. Thank you. Uh, Kathy, are you available to participate? Yes. Okay, number 11. Um, where they, yes, very good in English. Okay, in this case, you don't need the, the word yes, okay? Just, were they very good at English? The answer will be yes. Okay. Yes, they were. They were very good at, at English. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, 12. Uh, Mauricio. Are you available, Mauricio? Wilbur, are you available? Salvador? Are you available to participate? William Rocket? Hello. Liliana? Liliana, Laura, Robert. Yes, teacher. Um, I, yo estoy como oyente, teacher, porque se fue la energía y no ha regresado y en algún momento se me va a apagar el inter, pero sí puedo participar. Okay. Um, number 12. Where the dogs in the living room? Okay, very good. Thank you so much, Robert. Okay, you see, guys, very, very easy uh, to make questions using the bird to be. Okay. I can see that you handle this topic. Okay. So you don't need um, more explanation how to use the bird to be. But if you have questions, please let me know and we can. Uh, we can make more examples, okay? But if you don't have questions, uh, we are going to do another activity. Let me see. Mm. What that your mother in the car? What you, it was your mom? Oh no, we are speaking about your mother. We are speaking about she. In this case, will be was was was, was. that your mother in the car? Uh huh. Because we are speaking about she. Okay, what's the confusion there? Okay, but very good, good job here. Uh, we're going to have um exercise. You are going to write seven questions about the recent events at your work, okay? Using the past tense of the verb be. Then you are going to ask your classmates the questions and everybody will going to share the answer, okay? I will give you five minutes or 10 minutes if you need more time and in order we can ask questions to everybody, okay? Write uh, seven questions about recent events at your work or any other information that you want to ask your, your classmates about their jobs or places where they work, okay? Um, using the verb be. For example, let me see, let me see, for example, when did you start it? Oh no, in this case, the bird is, is normal. When did you start to work 
in your company. Ok, ¿cuándo iniciaste a trabajar en tu empresa? When did you start to work in your company? Ok. Using, you can use uh, did or you can use the verb um, to be. That is optional if you use did because it is not the main uh, purpose to use did, but you have an idea how to use it if you use did, the verb to do. But the main um, objective is that you use the verb be, was, or where. Okay. Similar the the okay. similar the other questions that we was was study. or where teacher was or where yes. Oh, but you can the question we que dijo when did you. Yes, you can also use did if you want. También puedo utilizar el did porque estamos hablando en pasado. Okay. Okay. But the main purpose now is use the verb to be. Was ah, okay, and where. Okay. Was and where. Okay. Uh -huh. But if you want to use did, you can use it. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. For example, another example, it could be where you um Were you willing to learn in your first training at work? Estaba dispuesto a aprender en tu primer training, en tu trabajo? Were you willing to learn in your first training at work. That is one example. Try to think. Think about possible questions that you can ask someone about uh, experiences in the workplace using past tense, especially yeah. where to be. Yes? Carlos? For example, you were in the office yesterday? If you make a question, will be, were you? Were you? Oh, okay. Were you at the office yesterday? Uh-huh. Good. Good question. Were you? Okay. Mm -hmm. If you want to ask questions about about someone else, like a partner, co-worker, or the, or the boss, you can do it too. For example, was your boss um, helpful your first week your first week at work one example where your co-workers friendly the first date a job of your work Examples like that, okay?
seven questions. Were you happy with your first check? With the primer check? Give me one minute, okay? Continue working. Okay. I'm back. Teacher, when we use where or was in, in the beginning of the sentences, the, the pair is going to be in the past on present simple or simple present will be uh simple because you are using the auxiliary that is where or was mm -hmm. and it's the same when we use uh did yes it is okay thank you okay Remember, also, you can use the like questions from yesterday, right? For example, were you tired? Were you tired yesterday? Were you late? Were you late? at work this morning? Really, teacher. <clears throat> Are you ready? Gilberto? Yes. Okay. I was study tomorrow English. Gilberto, remember that is question. Questions, Gilberto. 
Can you repeat that sentence no for me? Can you re repeat that sentence for me, please? You said that it is, no. I was... I was studying tomorrow English. I was studying tomorrow. Yes. Okay. If you if you use past tense, Gilberto, you never use phrases in future because if you translate that, you are saying, "Yo estaba estudiando mañana." Right. Oh. Uh -huh. Avoid to use tomorrow when you are speaking in past. In past. Will be yesterday. Yesterday. Sería, I yeah. was studying yesterday. Okay. I was studying English yesterday. Okay. Okay. So, but you are going to make that question, okay? Because that is a positive sentence. It will be, uh, okay, sí, sí. was I... Was I uh -huh. studying Was I English studying yesterday? English tomorrow. Yesterday. yesterday. Okay. Also you okay. can change in and use you. I'm going to use I you can see. Uh where you Were you studying English? Were you yesterday? No, but uh, estabas estudiando inglés ayer? Or or you can do it like it. Did you estudiaste, right? Did you study? Ahí no usamos el ing por el verbo normal. Did you study English yesterday? Yes. ¿Estudiaste inglés ayer? Did you study English yesterday? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. I did. I am was. I am this. I am this. If you answer that question with did, if I ask you, did you study English yesterday? You're going to say, yes, I did. Yes, I did. Okay. Okay. Yes, I did. Yes. Mm -hmm. If I ask you, were you studying English yesterday? ¿Estabas estudiando inglés ayer? Yes, I was. I did. I was. Si yo le pregunto con el verbo to be, usted me responde con el verbo to be. Si yo le pregunto con el verbo okay. to do, usted me responde do. con el verbo to do. Ok. Number two, teacher, you were called my mother last week. Repeat that. You were called my mother last week. You were called my mother last, last week. week. So, if that is a question, were you? Mm -hmm. Were you? Were you? Were you called my mother last week? Okay, in this case, it will be better if we use did. Did you call? Llamaste, okay? No el, verbo to, no el verbo be, el verbo to do. Did you call? Be. Did you call my mother last week? Last week. Mm -hmm. That would be the correct question. Did you call? My mother last week. How will be the answer? Mm -hmm. right. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. If that is negative, no. I did no, not. No, I didn't. I didn't. Uh huh.
Okay, Gilberto, check the ones that you have, please. Make sure that are correct. Okay. Me, teacher. Okay, let me see. Okay. Raise your hands and, and in the order that you have, raise your hands so go, you're going to participate. Okay, Andres, you will be the for the second one. Go ahead, Andres. It's correct if I say, teacher, did you shoot a weapon in your life? Did you? Shoot. Shoot. Shoot a weapon in your life? I can say in your life, like uh, if 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 I want to say the past mm. or in the past. No, it's perfect. It's better if I say, "Did you shoot a weapon in the past?" In the past. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm going to say. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Did you shoot a weapon in the past? Okay, the first one. Oh, uh, or it could be yesterday. You can also change that phrase yesterday okay to emphasize that was in the past uh, okay mm -hmm. because if you if you said in your life it will be have you as disparado pero eso es otro otro verbo otro tiempo okay have okay. you have you shoot a weapon yesterday no in your life in your you life. Want, oh, if okay. you want to use that phrase in oh, your okay. life, okay. but it, so. the verb will be in past participle. What is the past participle of should? Should it? Should. 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 What will be the past participle? Shouldn't. Shooting, shooting, if possible. Shot. Shooting. No, it will be just yeah. con una O. En, pre en, en presente es con dos O, pero en past participle will be just with one O. Shot. No. Shot. 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 Okay. Have you shot? Oh. Have, have you shot in your life? Have you shot a weapon in your life? Have you shot a weapon, weapon in your, your life? life? Ajá, ha disparado una pistola en tu vida. Okay, have you shot a weapon in your life? That will be the correct question if you do it with that phrase. But if you want to emphasize that was yesterday or um, in the past time, you can say, did you shoot a weapon, a weapon yesterday? Okay. 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 Good. The second one, when was your son or daughter born? Or when was your when was your son born? When was your son born? When was your son born? Okay. When was your first meeting in your company? Okay, good. What did you do? What did you eat at your work in the lunch yesterday? Okay, good. What time did you arrive for your to your job yesterday? What okay. time did you arrive to your job yesterday? Okay. Yes. Did you have some problem in your job the last week? Okay, good. Did you visit some client of your job the last month? Okay. And I don't know if it's correct that I say this sentence. Where you fell, where, I'm sorry, where you feel for the earthquake the last week? How did you feel? How did you feel? Okay. Mm -hmm. How did you feel? Or also you can say, uh, were you scared? Oh, okay, scared. Were you scared in the earthquake last week? Okay, but you are asking like a, a specific info, a, a feeling, right? A specific yeah, information. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. Yes. Very good. Andres. Okay, Hazel. Okay. Where you made presentation at the work? Where was you your made presentation at the work? Mm. Like PPT. I don't know. Did you? In this case, will be okay. did you? Did okay. you make a presentation? Okay. Was your boss part of your initial interview? Was your yeah good very good. Um, were you early this morning at the work? Good. Did you use uniform yesterday? Good. Were you busy at the office in the morning? Very good. Did you work yesterday? Yes. And did you have vacation last year? Very good. Yes. Okay. Good, Thank good. Thank you. Daniela? And was I in the mail? Was I in the mail? My mail. I'm sorry. Can you please spell M -A -L -L. that? M A L L. M A L L. Oh, mall. Mall. <laughs> mm -hmm. okay. Where where was I in the mall? Uh -huh. Was I in the mall? Mm -hmm. Uh, was she waiting for tortilla? Okay. Where were they in the park? Okay. Were there were they dancing? Dancing? Mm -hmm. Good. Was I eating potato? Yes. Um, was he watching a movie yesterday? Okay. Were we at the dance that night? Where we? Uh, where were we at the dance last night? Okay. Good. Thank you so much. Okay, good. Uh, Rolando? Okay, teacher. Was she invited and you, you uh, drank a coffee? Were she invited? Or was, was, she, she, she was invited? she invited you a drank a coffee? Was she invited invite you to drink a coffee? Drink a coffee. Mm, in, in this pass, case, we're... in past drum, drink, mm, drum. Remember, remember when we use uh an auxiliary at the beginning of the question, the verb is in the normal way. Ah, okay, drink. Okay. Okay, but in this case, will be did she? Did she? Ah, okay. Te invito. Okay. Did she invite you? Okay. To drink a coffee. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. Was I work in my company? Was I work in my working, company? Working. Working. In my company. Estaba yo trabajando? Uh-huh. Ah, okay. Did you say did you say me last week? Did you see Say me? Sit me. Sit me. Me viste. No, say decir. Decir. Sí, ya. Yeah. Say, say me. No. Did you say me? Mm. No. No. 
Now in this case, uh, me dijiste, right? Uh -huh. Did you, did you tell me? Oh. Ah, okay. Es, okay, don't confuse. El verbo say y el verbo tell. Ajá, uh -huh. okay. Uh -huh. Did you tell me? Okay. Mm -hmm. Did you believe me last year? Did you believe me? Last yes, year. Creiste, believe me. Yes, I know, I know. But um it is needed it is needed more information there. Okay, porque me dice me, me creíste el año pasado, but I don't mm -hmm. know no sé qué información. You said ah, okay. Uh -huh. Did you believe what I told you? Okay, ¿me creíste lo que te dije? Did you believe what I told you last year? Okay, what else? Okay. Uh, was I happy in the morning? Was I happy in the morning? Okay. Did you eat for a lunch? What did you eat for lunch? Or did you eat lunch? Did did you eat? Did you eat lunch? Okay. It is not needed for there. Or just okay. did you eat lunch? Did you like ice cream? Okay. Um yesterday did you dry slowly remember yesterday will be at the end at did the you end. did you drive slowly you drive? yesterday mm -hmm. okay where they play soccer did they play did soccer? they mm -hmm. okay Thank you, teacher. Only. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much. Cindy. Hola, teacher. Hi. Was, the, was she doing the coffee this morning? Were you often check your email? Okay. Let analyze one by one. Mm -hmm. Number one again. You said, did you? Oh, no. no. You said, was? Was she? Uh -huh. Dream. Drink. Coffee in the morning. Coffee in the morning. Okay, in this case will be, did she? Did she drink? A coffee. Dream, a coffee in the morning. In the morning. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Number two. Okay. She was. Was she? Was she the the visit to client? Was she visiting the clients? Visiting the clients? Okay. Or did she visit the clients? Did she visit the client? Mm -hmm. Only teacher. Only two? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um. Try to... Analyze the scenario, the context. Uh, mm, I don't know how to 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 explain that to avoid that you confuse. Mm -hmm. How to make questions with the verb be or the verb do? Okay, the verb uh to be or the verb or the verb to do. I guess you have confusion. Uh, what kind of uh, verb or auxiliary used to make questions. 
So I, I'm going to bring more exercises to clarify that, okay? Yes, Carlos? Uh, my example teacher, excuse me. Mm -hmm. Okay. I try to, okay. Um, what kind of report did you do today? Okay, good. Uh, how many emails did you send? Okay. Uh, was he waiting for 15 minutes? Good. Um, uh, were you... No, come on. Were you late for training? Were you late for training? Okay. Uh, were you fired from your job? Okay. Uh, were they working yesterday? Good. Teacher, in this case, uh, I can use ING, no problem. Were you working yesterday? Yes. I mean, if you are using the verb V, you can use ING in past. Oh. Oh, okay. okay. If you are using the verb V in past, you can use ING because you are asking if you were doing that, right? Were you in training yesterday, for example? Okay. Uh huh. Estaba en training ayer. Okay. Yes. But you are using in past tense. Okay. Uh, but the, uh, okay. there, are, there uh, are some questions. Where... Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, were the bus shooting when I came in later? Was the bus shooting so, when I came in later? Okay. Um, only teacher. Only that. Yes. Okay. Um. Thank you so much. Someone else. Who is ready? Let me know, please. Nobody? <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to use the, the rules of names. Voy a utilizar la ruleta, okay? Para que ahora los que ya tienen esas preguntas, try to ask one or two questions one of your classmates. Las preguntas más apropiadas que ustedes crean que pueden responder sus compañeros. ¿okay? Si usted no tiene una pregunta que le pueda hacer a un compañero, trate de adaptarla para que se la pregunte. ¿Ok? Ya, ya vimos uh, if they are okay or not. So now you are going to make questions to your classmates in past tense. Be ready. Para darles más tiempo, voy a agregar sus nombres aquí. Si no, las, si no están listos, try to, try to make one or two questions, okay? Si usted no me responde cuando yo le diga que participe, significa que no está poniendo atención, que no está ahí. Oh, let me change. Um, the attendance too. También voy a pasar la attendance porque ayer se me olvidó. But I remember you. I can do it later when we finish. I remember you if you were here, if you participated. Who is missing? ¿Quién me falta? 
¿Alguien me falta acá? Gilberto, Andrés, Carlos, Liliana, Liliana, Daniela, Rolando, Silvia, Hazel, Katy, Wilber, Cindy, Salvador, Mauricio, William. Okay, let me take that then dance first. Carlos? Excuse me, teacher. Just I'm taking the attendance. Okay, present, present. Yes. Cindy? Cindy present, teacher. Okay. Present. Daniela? Present, teacher. Gilberto? Present. Juliana? Present, teacher. Hazel? Present. Jose Andres. Present teacher. Carla Idari. Katy. Present. Lady. Present teacher. Liliana. Present teacher. Maria Leticia. Maria Leticia is not here, right? Hoy no vino. No está. Hey, Mauricio. Present teacher. Robert. Roberto Carlos. Rolando. Present teacher. Salvador. Present teacher. Silvia Estela. Present teacher. Wilber Francisco. And William. You can see Wilber here, but está oyente dice. Pia William, pero se me ha desconectado. Se desconectó. Ok. No sí, es que yo, teacher, teacher, tiene el mismo problema que mi persona, que ya casi se nos acapagan los teléfonos, porque no hay luz en ciertas zonas. Ah, ok. Sorry about that. Ok. No problem. Mm, we're missing just 30, well, 27 minutes, ok. And we are going to complete this class. But thank you so much for the ones that are still here. Um, okay, before you go, the ones that um, probably will get disconnected before uh, we finish the class, make sure that you complete the homework, okay? 14 and uh, 15. And complete also the, the meter exam if you haven't completed yet. Please do it. Next week will be uh, the final exam. Okay. Let me see who will be the first one. Mm, think who will be your partner. Okay. The one that you are going to ask the questions. Have that in mind. ¿A quién le van a preguntar? And what, and what kind of questions in, pa, in past tense? <laughs> okay, Carlos, you're the first one. <laughs> okay, who will be your, okay. your uh, classmate? The one okay, that no you're problem. going to ask. Okay. Um... I choose my my partner or 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 yes you do it okay um maybe Andres Andres okay yeah you're ready <laughs> in in I try to ask him the the question okay 
Okay, uh, how many e emails did you send? Yesterday or today? Uh, yesterday. Okay. I sent, I sent about 16 emails yesterday. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you, Carlos. Do you have another question, Carlos, or only that? No, no uh, what kind of report did you do today? Um, I didn't. I didn't make a. a I or I didn't do a report today. Okay. Um. Sometimes, uh, where did you fight from your job? Um, or alguna I, vez? Um, yes, and I were, I was fired from, from, from tw twenty, twenty. A twenty eighteen year for the year of twenty eighteen, okay. yeah. Okay. I was fired in two thousand in two thousand eighteen. Two thousand eighteen. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much, Carlos. Next. Thank you. Salvador, are you here? Are you available? Yes. Okay. Ready? I think so. Okay. Who will be your your uh, partner? Your classmate? Uh, Hazel. Hazel. Okay. De acuerdo. Abriendo Facebook. Ok. Tiene un robot, dijo Carly. <ríe> ok. Hazel. Un bot. Un robot. ¿Estás ahí, Hazel? Sí, estoy aquí. Ok. Hazel, ¿estás ahí? Ok. La primera pregunta es: ¿Cuántos envíos de envíos procesos la semana? How many? Okay. Try to try to do it again, Salvador. Complete question, okay? How many? Uh huh. How many invoice? Mm -hmm. Process. Did you process? Did you? Mm -hmm. Did you process oh. last month? Well, did I, you process I, last month? I think I didn't process anyone. None. None. Anyone. I didn't process. Yes, I didn't process anyone. Okay. Mm -hmm. Salvador, do you have another question? Sincerely, sincerely, no. <laughs> <laughs> no tenía otra. Okay. Well, try to think about different questions, okay? Not only one. Okay. Um, okay. <clears throat> let me see who will be next. Liliana. Are you there? Yeah. Okay. Who will be your uh, classmate? Um, Gilberto. Gilberto. Okay. Okay. Where do you work every day? 
uh, yes, I was uh, Monday, Tuesday, Miracle, uh, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Okay. Did you? Okay. Just, just a moment, Liliana. Where you work every day? Um. Uh, it sounds like a, that is. Uh, do you work? Do you work every day? Right? Do you work every day? So remember, in past, past tense, for example, yeah. it could be, mm -hmm. did you work, uh -huh, did you work the complete week or the whole week or this week? Did you work this week? Okay. We know that the week already passed because we are Friday, right? So, did you work this week? Trabajó mm -hmm. toda esta semana. Okay. Mm -hmm. How will be your answer, Gilberto? Uh, yes, I did. Yeah, yes, I did. Uh, I worked. Working, I worked uh, from Monday, Monday to Friday. Wednesday. Wednesday, Tuesday, Friday. Okay, from Monday to Friday. To avoid that you repeat all the days of the week, you can say just from Monday to Friday. To, to Monday to Friday. Mm -hmm. Correct. Okay. okay, thank you, Liliana. William, are you there, William? Mm -mm -mm. No, it's not here. Okay. okay. Daniela. Daniela, reset. Okay. Okay, who will be your uh, interviewee, your partner, your um, classmate? Cindy? Cindy, okay. Right here. Okay. Where did you check in the report? I, I checked the report. Every day. Okay. Did you eat the beans? It come what? Did you eat the beans? Mm. Yes. Yes, I eat the beans. Okay. Yes, I did. did yes, I did. I ate, I ate, I ate the beat, the beat, the beat, okay. Did you dance with my mom? Did you, repeat please. Did you dance with my mom? Dance, oh, Do I like to call my mom? Did you, uh huh? Did you dance with my mom? Uh, with uh, my mom. Yes, no. I did, or no, no I, I didn't. No, I didn't. Only did it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, Wilbur. Are you there, Wilbur? Wilbur Francisco. 
Ok. Gilberto. Ok. Rolando. Rolando. Ok. Eh. He, he was cooking in in weekend. Yes, I did. Uh, I cooking weekend. All right. Okay. Yes. Thank you both. So, where are you? Where are you? Where are you cooking? Uh -huh. Were you cooking or did you cook? Did you cook? Did you cook last weekend? Weekend. Okay. Uh -huh. Did you cook last weekend? Yes, I did. Or no, I didn't, right? Okay, Rolando. Tell me. Did what? Did what? Uh, he was working on Sunday, last Sunday? No, I didn't. Okay, guys, golden rule. Okay, una, una regla de oro. Uh, never use did and, and was together. Did was. Did was. No, never. Never. Uh, never. Okay, okay, did you? Never. Did you? Okay. Did you? Uh -huh, did, did you, you work? Did you work last Sunday? Okay. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay, good. Thank you so much, Gilberto. Uh, Rolando, tell me. You you was reading a book, the suspense. Did repeat repeat, Gilberto. Could, could you repeat that, please? You was reading a book, suspense. Oh, uh, you was. Or was you? You was. Oh. Um, no, no, I didn't read the, the book, a suspense. Okay, uh, thank you so much, uh, Rolando. Okay, Gilberto. ¿Qué dijimos que iba antes? Eh, en una pregunta. Uh, el auxiliar yeah. o, el, o el sujeto. El auxiliar, etcétera, was you reading? Porque usted lo vuelve, lo el, vuelve a repetir. Él, 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 él le pregunta y usted lo vuelve a repetir. Right? Yes, understand. Ok, try to memorize that rule, ok? Ok. Okay, uh, let me see, just a moment. Hazel, are you there? Hazel. Oh, sorry, uh, yes, I'm here, yes. <laughs> sorry, okay. I'll take you out of the microphone. <laughs> okay. Okay, boy, uh, so... Maybe, I don't know, Cindy? Cindy, okay, Cindy. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, so, um, were you early this morning at the work? Yes, yeah. yes, I did. Were you? Were you? So. Yes, I was. 
Okay. Ending. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Okay, remember when she used the verb be, because she told you, were you, right? You will answer with the verb be. Yes, I was. If she, told, if she asked you one question with did you, then you're going to say yes, I did, or yes, or no, I don't. Okay. Okay. Do you have so, another Cindy, question? Yes. So, Cindy, did you work yesterday? Did, did you can work yesterday? Yes, yes, I did. Okay, thank you, Cindy. Thank you. Thank you so much, both. Okay, Cindy, now your turn. My turn. <laughs> um, Daniel? Daniela, ¿se fue? Are you there, Daniela? Uh, sí, yeah. Okay. How often do you drink coffee at work? How often? How often? No, I didn't. How often did you... Mm. Mm. Okay, in that case, the, how often? No. Do not use that because that is when we use a uh, simple present, okay? When we use simple present, we use how often. So in this case, it will be, uh, do, did you, okay. Did you drink coffee at work? Did you drink coffee at work yesterday or today? I don't know today in the morning, so it refers to the past. Se refiere al tiempo pasado, ¿ok? Ah, ok. Entonces sería, did you drink coffee at work in the morning? Uh -huh. No, no, I didn't drink coffee. Ok, um, finally, did you go to the cinema in this weekend? Previously. No, I didn't. Okay, remember. No, okay, thank you. Previous week or last week? Because we are talk talking about the past. If we said this weekend, it means that this weekend that is coming, right? So that is um tomorrow. And that is no used in the in this in these questions that we are talk talking about the past, okay? Okay. Yeah, try mm -hmm. to make sure what kind of phrases uh you use to complete this, the, the question, okay? Esas okay. frases tienen que ver mucho en el contexto si es pasado o futuro, okay? Como estaba diciendo el ejemplo Gilberto, eh, que, que mencionaba pasado y luego decía tomorrow. So never use that phrases that, is, that are talking about future because you are talking about past tense, okay? Están hablando del pasado. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Let me see who is next. The last one, okay? Because we don't have time. We're going to complete the homework. Okay, Andres. Hey, teacher. Mm -hmm. Who will be your partner? <coughs> Carlos. Carlos. Carlos, I don't know. Yeah. Do you have... A do you have a children? Do you have children? That is not yeah. a question, but I wanna, I wanna know. <laughs> well, yes, I it's do. all that. Okay. When was your son or daughter born? Uh, when was your son or daughter? Excuse I don't me? know if you have a son. Your son. Or daughter. I don't know if you have a son daughter. or a daughter. 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 When they when they born. They were born. Do you have two or only oh. one, Carlos? 
Uh, two children. Two, okay. Also, say when they were born. When were they born? Yeah. When were born? Mm -hmm. When um, were they born? Teacher, a mí solo el 1% me queda de batería. It's okay, Silvia, don't worry. Don't worry, you can leave the meeting if you want. Just make sure that you complete the homework, 14, okay? Okay, okay. Yes, um, Carlos, you can say, my, for example, my son was born in, okay, in July 2022. They Exactly. were they were born in uh, 2014 and 2021. Okay. Okay, that's good. What did you eat at your work in the lunch yesterday? Uh I didn't eat in my uh, war. I ate in my uh, house. Okay. Okay. Um. How do you feel for the f the for the earthquake the last week? Um. Uh, I did feel. Uh, I, didn't. I didn't. I didn't feel uh, nervous. Maybe. Okay. Okay, okay teacher. That's all. Okay, very Thank good. You. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, guys, we're going to move on here to the homework. 14. 14. Number one, Picasso was or were a Spanish painter? Was. 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 There was or were a mouse were. in the garden? Were. We was or were playing football? Were. Where it was or where a rainy day was it was the children was or were in the park where where, where? okay there you have the answers <sighs> oh no I'm sorry it was here because it's it remember it's just one. Sorry about that. It is eat. It is an animal. Okay. Good. Send it, please. There you are. You are done with the that uh, homework 14. Okay, guys. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate your time. Uh, I hope you enjoy your weekend. Okay. I hope to see you on Monday again. Take care. Rest. Thank you for your you. Okay. See you. Take care, guys. Thank you. Okay, teacher. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you next Monday. See you next Monday. Bye. Bye, teacher. Bye-bye.